Hey guys, it's Shara Knight Paladin and welcome to Inktober 2016 and I believe this is the 8th video and the last video for this year with Inktober and it has been very surprisingly fast. I didn't think that one month would switch by that quickly and I didn't think that I would be able to hold on until the last few or the last second video, this video, but I did. So. Well, I don't think I'll be bulking in the next day, so I did hang on, so yay! Cool! Right, so we'll, we are on day 29, so just two more days until the end of October. On Saturday this week, I will be switching out my usual content for an Inktober flip through, which is pretty much like a sketchbook flip through, but just for the Inktober thing. Just to recap and review, make some comments here and there. And I think it would be fun. Okay, to talk about this piece for today, I'm doing a cat girl and I'm keeping in line with the Halloween costume fantasy esque thing I had to do for the last week before Inktober ended. And I liked how it turned out. I am using the fine liners this time. Attempt at least the brush markers were lined with, but I felt like I could easily mess up. Uh, the entire piece if I made a mistake with the brush marker. So I switched back to the fine liner and originally I was gonna keep it just black and white or with just line width and line art. But I changed my mind since it's the last three days and I wanted to add in a bit more detail and effort to these last three days. I added in a little bit of color just to accentuate some parts, just to give it some more life and make it a bit more vibrant. Nothing too crazy like when I did the first week, but just to make it look a bit more finished. So that's what I did. I think I'll be continuing that for the next two for the next two days. Um, I might even do a full blown hardcore completed piece on the thirty first, just to wrap it up nicely. So. Please stay tuned for day 30. There's only a 3 segment video since there, well, there are not enough days to make it a 4 segment video. So still, please stick around. I'll be showing all of, the, all of these at the end of day 31st. And then, yeah. So welcome to day 30. My audio kind of um, went past with my intended time limit yesterday. So hey, welcome back to day 30. Um, I decided to do a close-up this time. Um, everything I said yesterday is still more or less applied to today. I wanted to make it more finished, less rushed, a little bit of a little bit more effort, and I'll be using a bit of color. So I didn't know what I wanted to do at first, and then I kind of looked around for some references for a thing, and then flipped through my sketchbook just to see what I've already done. And I decided to do a succubus. These are the counterpart to the incubus, which are demons that seduce people. And what do they do to their victims? Do they steal their souls or do they... Well, I know with the, with the incubus, they make their victims pregnant. With the succubus, I think they eat your soul or something. I, I don't know, I forgot. Either way, I wanted to make one, or draw one at least. So we have the typical succubus um, treats, even though it's closed up, you have the horns, we have this kind of fancy grandois, grandois um, outfit with the pop-up color. Um, I made her hair, well, I made her makeup and eyes very striking and uh, it would easily catch attention. And then I made her hair a very sweet color, so there's like this sweet devil type of feel to her. Tomorrow, I might do a really hardcore, um, really detailed, put in all the effort video or um, drawing, I mean. So I'll be doing it full color, full line art, width thing, as much detail as I could, as I could fit on this notebook. And I hope you'd stick around for that. It'll be right after the preview for this. And I'll see you there.
Hey guys, welcome back. It's Shadow Knight Paladin and welcome to day 31. I almost did my intro there. Good thing I caught myself. And we are at the end of Inktober. And dang, I didn't think I'd get to this point. I thought I'd buckle halfway through. And if you've been watching my videos throughout the month, you saw that I was slowly losing steam and inspiration. And I was starting to make simpler pieces and just spending like 30 minutes maximum on them. But for the last week, this particular week, I decided to create more finished looking pieces. And for day 31, today, I will be doing a complete piece. And I'll be pulling out all the stops, all the works. Um, it's gonna be fully colored. I'll be doing all the line widths that I usually do with the bigger pieces. So just to wrap things nicely, and at least I put in a lot of effort on the last piece. I put in a lot of effort in the first week and then the last piece. Well, I didn't think. Well, I knew that the drawing every day was tough, but. <laughs> so, uh, the theme was something a bit more angelic and pure, um, soft, uh, relaxing, gentle, uh, something like that along those lines. It's because for the past two pieces that I did for this particular video, they were very seductive and sexy and taunting, I guess. So, I wanted to contest that out with something angelic looking so the original concept was that she was some sort of angel guarding the gates of heaven or something to that effect so i used very soft and sweet colors i'm using the sakura micron pigma pen of zero to weight and the uni pin zero five pen to create the line weights i'm using the faber castell 48 set classic colored pencils to color it in obviously and the Uniball Signal White, which a lot of YouTubers, art YouTubers here, use to create highlights, and I do use it a lot. If only it was really, if only I could find them easily. I only found them in one particular bookstore, and it's not that easy to get to for me. But it's another topic for some other day. So please stick around after this preview. I will be showing the pre well, I'll be showing the other pieces I did for this video, and then this Saturday. I will be replacing my normal video of speed paints with a Inktober sketchbook flip through. So I'll be showing all of the pieces that I did, provide some feedback, and stay tuned in for that. I think it will be fun to do. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys had fun with Inktober if ever you did participate. And um, like or subscribe. I do a lot of fan art. And um, yeah, yeah. 